y'all, I'm back, and today we have something a little different, and I'm super excited about it. My friend Valerie recently visited the wonderful, the only, Canada, and I've never been to Canada, but one day I wish to go to Canada. It is definitely on the bucket list. Anyhow, she recently was blessed enough to make it out there, and she picked me up some scratch-off tickets, so that's what we're going to be doing today. Now keep in mind, this video is going to be a little long. Um, I have a $2 ticket, a $1 ticket, and then we have a $3 more Lucky Lines, I think is what it's called. Um, and this is really kind of like a bingo slash loteria ticket, so this is going to take a little while, but I'm doing them all on one video. So we'll start with this $3 ticket, <clears throat> just because I know it's going to take the longest, and we'll see how we do. This is a $3 Lucky Lines ticket. The overall odds are 1 in 3.27, including break-even prizes. This looks to be ticket number 20, and all we got to do is find some symbols in the, uh, in the symbol area. If we can find them in the play area, we scratch them. Any completed column, rows, or diagonals win the corresponding prizes up to $75,000. So let's see how we do on this guy. Moon and Ladybug. I think this ticket is so cute. Hopefully we'll find ourselves a winner. I get to mark another place off the bucket list because I've never scratched a Canadian ticket. So, get to do it for the first time today. Um, don't see any ladybugs. Let's try the bottom. Here's a ladybug right there. And then let's see a moon at the bottom. Let's go ahead and get the next two symbols. Gem and crown. Gem, gem, gem and crown. No gem or crown. No gem or crown. Oh look, I missed the ladybug earlier. Here's the ladybug. What about a gem? Nope. What about a crown? Nope. We have a gem here. Crown. Nope. Alright, let's look down here. We got crown. What about a gem and a gem? All right, let's see what the next ones are. Rainbow and banana. Symbols are so teeny tiny, they're kind of hard to see. Rainbow, banana. No rainbow, no banana. And also to let you guys know, I will be traveling soon. Um, I'll be doing the Match Monday video really early in the morning, Monday, like literally 1 a.m. or something, um, so that I can have it pre-recorded before I board the plane. But I'm headed off to Colorado for the week, so I'll have some pre-recorded videos, at least I plan to, that are Texas Lottery that I'll release while I'm away. Um, and then I'm definitely going to try to pick up some Colorado Lottery tickets to do for you guys. Tickets don't ever treat us too bad. I enjoy actually playing the Colorado tickets. I wish they didn't have those silly $1 matches, but all in all, they treat me pretty well. So we're going to try again and see if we can win a large prize while we're there. All right, orange and diamond. So just wanted to give you guys a heads up about that. Orange and diamond, nope. Nope. Lots of different fruits and lots of different shapes here. I think it's easy to get confused. Orange. And diamond. Diamond. You know, if I won a top prize on one of these Canadian tickets, I was asked, how do you claim it if you win? Well, if it was a top prize, I'd get on a plane and I'd go and claim it myself. Now, I don't know if Americans can claim Canadian lottery prizes, but, you know, if I paid for it, I assume I can. I guess we'd find out, huh? I also thought it was interesting that these tickets have an area where you're supposed to sign to acknowledge that you're over 18. Never seen that in the States. I'm sure something happened that caused them to have to add it, though. So 
some kid probably bought one, went to go claim it, and then realized he couldn't because he was not 18. At least I imagine that's what happened. Music and elephant. Music and elephant. We got the elephant. Music. Do we have the elephant? I don't see the elephant. Pot and plum. Plum, 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 and pot. Don't see it there. Oh, look, I missed the ace earlier. Plum. This plum picture is a little weird. And the bottom one, we got a plum right there. Do we have a pot? And we have a pot. All we need is the lemon for 1,000. Let's see if we can find a lemon. Could you imagine? Bell and pear. Bell and pear. Not there. What about over here? Nope. What about over here? Nope. Nope. Oh, look, there's a diamond I missed earlier, though. I'm the worst when it comes to these. Bell and pear. There's a bell. And there's a pear. All right. Next two. Coin and horn. Coin and horn. Coin. And corn. Wow, if we don't win on this one, they sure are teasing us. They're making it look like, like we might get a little something. Apple and sun. Apple and sun. Got the sun right here. Apple right there. And then the bottom, apple. What about the sun? You don't see the sun in the bottom. And then our last two symbols, pineapple and star. All right, pineapple and star. We got a pineapple right here, but no star. We got a star right here, but no pineapple. Star right there. There, right there. Let's look at the bottom. Pineapple and star. I don't see either of them at the bottom. So it looks like we got ourselves a loser on our hands, missing multiple symbols to make any column, row, or diagonal anywhere on this ticket, it appears. Um, so let's see if the bonus area can save us. We're just looking for three of the same symbol in order to win here. I'm sorry, three of the same dollar amount. Nope, all right, so this $3 more lucky lines or lucky more lines, I don't know, it's a loser. All right, next we're going to do the $1 bacon bucks. I like this, this is the cutest thing ever. And we basically have lucky numbers. If we can match the lucky number, we win. If we find a pig symbol, then we win $5 instantly. So we're looking for 15 and 10. Or some piggies. We got one, seven, nine, four, nineteen, and three. So bacon bucks is a loser. This was ticket number forty-three. Top price is ten thousand dollars, and overall odds are one in four, which isn't bad for a one-dollar ticket, actually. All right, and last we have this super cute sushi bar. It's like a slot. Um, we're just looking for three of the same symbol in order to win the corresponding prize. Top prize is $35,000. It's a $2 ticket, Sushi Bar Bucks. Ticket number 19, and overall odds, one and 3.53. So let's see how we do.
And again, I think those are pretty good odds for a $2 ticket. We got a fish. Rye, so this one's not going to be a match. And fish. Next one. Plate. Fish. Octopus. All right, two more shots. Rice. Plate. Shrimp. And last one. Roll. Cucumber. And roll. So it looks like it's a loser. So we struck out on these Canadian lottery tickets, but when you get one of each, that's kind of what's expected. But you know what? It was still a lot of fun. I'm so glad I got a chance to scratch some Canadian lottery tickets. So thanks again to my friend Valerie for making it possible. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Bye.